Lillian, I promise to always value your intelligence, embrace your eccentricity, and celebrate your passion. I will always encourage you to harness your inner clown and entertain others as much as you entertain me. I will always be here, sitting beside you after your long day, listening to your thoughts and thinking I'm the luckiest man alive to be able to do so. I vow to support you in every way I am able, sharing the burden of your disappointments and rejoicing ecstatically in your successes. I promise to be your constant, your unfaltering pillar, your rock. But most importantly, I vow to love you with all my heart until time itself blinks its last. Lillian, you mean everything to me, and I promise to show it every single day. Hello, everyone. Hello. Um, <clears throat> well, welcome to the Dream Factory. Uh, aptly named an aptly named place and also a pivotal point in the life of our young group. And it's uh, here today that Lillian and Paul join their lives together in holy matrimony and only a year behind schedule, uh, which is great for the UK. Dear Paul, I vow to always be grateful for the moments we spent together. The past five years have been nothing but wonderful, and spending a whole year together last year, literally 24-7, has made me understand deeply that there's no one I'd rather spend my life with, and that as long as we are together, there will always be love and laughter. My favorite author, John Green, as you know, he once said, imagine others complexly, and that's something you've always taught me to do. You're always kind and generous to everyone, and you always remind me that whatever we don't have, we already have lots more than others do. I love that we have the same sense of humor, although sometimes questionable. <laughs> we share the same values and celebrate different cultures. I cannot wait to travel the world again with you. I promise to be by your side through the best times and the worst times, but we'll still let you have your pole time so you can watch Drag Race in peace. <laughs> <laughs> I love you, and I promise to always love you. Honour and a privilege to declare you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride! <laughs> I present to you your newlyweds, Lily the Paul! It is remarkable to me that two souls so in line, so right for each other, who were born on opposite sides of the world and spent decades living independent lives in complete isolation, can somehow ricochet through billions of other people and find themselves looking into the eyes of their soulmate. It is a strange anomaly, a statistical stretch, and the source of so much gratitude to them. I love her so much. I love you so much. And I will do everything I can to make you happy. 